Hey guys and girls, so a lot of you have asked and sent me messages about my Cura settings. So I do put all my um, models into Cura and then uh, export them to my SD card. I don't have my 3D printer connected to my PC because I just, I, it doesn't work very well to be honest doing it that way. If you've got any tips or tricks on that, comment below. So I'm just going to talk you through my Cura settings. I'm using Cura 15.04.6. I'm um, going to start on the basic tab and work our way through. So you can see here the quality, my layer height is 0 0.2, my shelf thickness is 1.6 with retraction enabled. If we go into the more detailed settings on retraction, I've got a uh, minimum travel of 1.5 enabled combing all, uh, maximum extrusion before retraction is 0 0.02 and Z hop when retracting is 0, 0.0. Uh, fill is 1.6 with a fill density of 35. Okay, solid infill top, solid infill bottom, infill overlap 1.5 or 15. Um, speed and temperature, so a print speed of 35. I find that if I print above 35, I get loads of issues. I get layers not sticking together, um, quite a lot of vibrations on the machine so if anyone knows how to fix that if it's a setting or if it's something to do with the printer again please comment below uh, print temperature is 210 so the printing PLA not ABS uh, support type everywhere and I'll show you the settings for that so I do switch these about depending on what I'm printing but um, for the support everywhere I've got lines on the structure type I've got overhang of 35 fill amount of 40 uh, distance on XY 0.7, distance on Z 0.15 and that's the same for touching build plate. So again lines 35, 40, 0.7 and 0.15. Uh, rafts and brims, so we'll start with the brim setting at 20 and if we look at the raft some more in-depth settings and I'm going to mess about with these at the weekend and if I get a better result I'll post a little update on that. So uh, extra margin 5.0, line space 3.0, base thickness 0.3, baseline 1.0, uh, interface thickness 0.27, interface line 0.4, air gap of 0.0, first layer air gap of 0.22, um, surface layers of 2, so two surface layers, surface layer thickness 0.27, surface layer line width 0.4. Again, if you've got any tips or tricks on the raft, be great to hear what you're using. Um, but again, I usually don't use any. Uh, diameter, filament uh, I'm using is 1.75, a flow of 75, and then my nozzle size, the nozzle that's on my printer at the moment is 0.4. Under the advanced tab, retraction speed is, like I say, 40. We've got a distance of 4.5, quality, uh, initial layer thickness of zero, initial layer line width of 100, cutoff object bottom 0, 0.0, dual extrusion overlap 0 0.15. Uh, speed, travel speed is 150, uh, bottom layer speed is 25, infill speed is 0, 0.0, and then top, outer shell, inner shell are all set to pretty much 0. Uh, cool, minimum layer time 5 seconds, enable cooling fan, yes, and then if we click that, We've got uh, fan full on at height 0 0.5, fan speed 100, fan speed 100 max. Uh, minimum speed 10, and that's that. Uh, that's just the plugins and uh, G-code stuff. So let's look at the machine settings. So I've called it a uh, ret wrap, and we've got uh, obviously E-step is at zero, maximum width is 200, maximum depth 200, maximum height 180. Extruder count one because I've only got one extruder on it. Um, it has actually got a heated bed, so that should be actually be ticked. Uh, machine center 0, 0.0. No build area shape. It's a square. G code flavor. Rep wrap Marlin Sprinter. Everything else set to 0, 0.0. And then serial port auto. Board rate auto. Done. This is very much specific on your type of printer, so don't just copy these randomly. You'll need to know what your settings are. Uh, like I say, um, I hope that's helped for those of you who want to know what settings I was using. Uh, hit that like button. Comment below if you've got any uh, tips or tricks on the settings or you think something's wrong or not set right, and I'll give it a go. And uh, thanks for watching.